Hi friends and welcome to Wakalama YouTube channel. I'm Natasha and I will be your host today. And from this beautiful place, I would like to start my episode. And now I'll show you how we got here. In this video, you will see all my VIPs, all the projects that I'm working on. I will not show you projects that are hibernating. Those projects you won't see in this video, but the ones that are active, I'll show all of them to you. Also, I will show you some yarn unboxing. Uh, I had uh, two packages that arrived this um, uh, past uh, few days as that I would like to share with you and also I have already two finished objects one of them is this beautiful hat summer hat that I knitted out of cotton and also I showed you in last episode I showed you uh, this ball of white yarn that I said I would like to knit hat out of it and that's what I did <laughs> okay so let's dive in and see all my projects and all my new yarn Uh, show you unboxing of yarn that I got from store in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Wolseley Wool. Every summer they have a sale and they have like really good sale up to 50-40% off. So and I decided to stock up on sock yarn and especially on those bright nine colors. So I got, uh, they basically all same company, it's Prolana, um, Prolana Socca Wool Uni and it's 75 percent superwash wool and 25 percent polyamide yep and this beautiful bright blue color is four to four and i got two of those and i think they put me one in uh, another blue one instead of gray probably they didn't have so i got two blue and then i got two nyan pink they're four to two color Okay, and then I got one nyan green and it's color 426, very beautiful. And the last color, nyan yellow, it's 420. 
so those are bright nine colors as you can see and then i also ordered like some just nat natural colors this one is brown 411 so i thought like you know if you need like whole soap brown and then just add some bright nine stripes or toe and heel like you know just to make them nice and bright and then i ordered a few of those gray ones but probably they didn't have it and so they gave me blue instead it's four or five very beautiful color and also this um hockey color for ten. so it's like uh just to use together with the bright ones or even like you know if you need bright socks and just do uh toe and heels just gray that will look good too and then i took uh, four balls of self-striping yarn so i have one color it's a uh, it's a company of lotta soke and it's rilana garden and it's like 75 superwash wool 25 um, polyamide so everything same and color is 1183 and it will make uh, this pattern sock and then i have three same colors very nice and bright and it's color 1185 and it will create this beautiful sock so that's 15 balls of yarn that I got from Mosley Wool. So I was so glad to share them with you. Hello friends, I would like to show you my new yarn inquiry that I got. Uh, this is amazing yarn from Knit Picks. It's Lindy Chain Fingering Weight. And this one in colorway uh, 26462, it's color plum. So it's kind of like brownish purple. And it's 70% linen, 30% prima cotton. So and I have four balls of this and I have this color. Oops, anyway. Color uh, 27004. And this color also is very beautiful. It's not just white. It's kind of like a super light bluish white color kind of cold white and it's same thing colorway mist and here's the colorway plum so and it's interesting story happened to me because when i ordered six balls from knit picks i received four in a parcel so i called a customer support service and i told them oh, the two balls are missing and in 24 hours later in my mailbox i had my two balls they sent they said that they'll send it for free and they did so i'm super excited like it's uh i always uh order a lot from knit picks and uh like over the years it's just my um uh, second time that something wrong was with order and they fixed it right away and uh, i think two years ago i ordered two tips for my needles and next i ordered um five millimeter and six millimeter needles and accidentally there came two six millimeter needles needle tips so i called them and they read the way they told me to keep second pair and they sent me five millimeter needle uh right away so their customer service is great I hope people are not uh, cheating them <laughs> because if they like trying to replace it so quickly, I hope no one is abusing it. But for me, it was really nice that they just fix it right away. <clears throat> and when I received this yarn, I right away did my cast on. So um, I have this color mist. Also, I had already in stars this color named Harbor. And when I, and I actually started to knit out of Harbor or already a small team, I'll insert picture here which one I wanted to knit. But now instead of knitting this top out of this beautiful uh, Harbor colorway, I ordered this plum color, brownish purple. And I will knit that top from colorway plum. And this I will unravel and I have four balls of harbor 
and harbor and mist will become one top and i'll insert a picture for you so i will i was happily knitting on this top when i saw a picture of this top on instagram and i just fell in love and it so much so i went and i pre i ordered different color because i i saw people knitting in uh, like whole top in one color and also they're knitting in two colors and i really loved the idea to knit in, in two colors and pattern pattern calls just for one ball uh for the lighter color but i decided to take two just in case so it would be enough and <clears throat> i cast it on right away and here just not much to show yet but yarn is very pleasant to work with and, and it feels like you don't want even put it down but i had to put it down yesterday because i had to put my uh, girl to bed uh, so that's my the freshest project on my needles another process that i have a vip on my needles it's this beautiful top that I'm totally freestyling. I'm knitting it out of 100% cashmere, Todd and Duncan, and I'm knitting it on 3.5 millimeter needles, and I'm holding thread double, because it's a once a one thread is 1,500 meters, 400 grams, and when I'm holding it double, I think it's 750 meters per 100 grams. And I'm working on this top since February because it's crazy amount of stitches. But what happened, I forgot to do short rows around the neck. And then I forgot to do them on the back. And I a third chance when I would have to do short row shaping, like to just to bring neckline on the back a bit higher. I also forgot to do it like underneath my arms. So now I'm not sure if I should just keep going or should I unravel some of it. But now on my needles I have almost 400 or a bit more than 400 stitches and it, it goes already very slowly. So I don't want to unravel it. So that's why this project is kind of frozen for a bit. Another exciting project that I have on my needles, it's this beautiful mohair shawl. I'm using two different colors from Drop Skin Silk. One of them, it's a unicolor jeans. And second of them, it's like sectional uh, kid silk. And I will insert a uh, number of colors because I don't remember them. <laughs> and that's what gives me a shawl like this and i was working quite aggressively and monogamously on this um shawl but then heat wave came and now it's just way too hot to work on it and it's a bit wrinkled because it was in my project bag okay but now soon uh, heat should uh, cool down a bit and then i'll go back to this beautiful process because i have here not that much left to finish this beautiful shawl Next project that I'm working about uh, on really aggressively, it's this beautiful cardigan. I'm knitting it out of uh, Kindred Decavate. It's in colorway cargo. It's from Knit Peaks. It's 68% baby alpaca and 32% per Peruvian prima cotton. And it has 150 yards on 50 gram. So one colorway is cargo and second colorway is a driftwood. Very, very beautiful colors. And I think they go together really well. I had six balls of each color. So I finished uh, sleeves already. And now I'm just freestyling and finishing. Like I'll just use up all the yarn uh, just down the body. And here I'll have buttons starting here. And so there will be a few buttons going down and it's very, very turning out super beautiful cardigan. Hi, 
Hi friends, another project on my needles. It's this little afghan that I'm knitting out of uh, soft, uh, super soft. It's I bought it at the Wormwool Gallery and it's super soft by Noel and it's in 100 grams here, 629 yards and it's pure new wool. I love this yarn very much and it will be um, kind of bling uh, afghan in squares so for contrasting colors i'm using uh, bricks and little uh sport it's 100 percent wool in this beautiful color forest i think and another contrasting color is also bricks and little and this colorway i lost tag and this one is super soft 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 angle tweed so i'm holding double strand one soft angle tweed and one bricks and little and i'm knitting this beautiful afghan another process that i started it's from cascade uh, one to eight superwash 100 percent superwash merino wool and in colorway cotton candy and it's uh, in each skein there's 100 uh, grams and 117 meters uh, so i have five skeins i already unwind them and i'm on my second ball uh, so i'm knitting on needles nine millimeters at 13 us and so i started to knit cardigans from the back so i cast on stitches for shoulders and neckline and then i did some uh, shaping for the shoulders and i knitted all back to the underarms then i picked up uh, stitches and i knitted neck band and when i was around shoulder shoulders then i together from neck band i picked up stitches for shoulders did shaping and now i'm knitting down together um until i arm uh, uh, until i reach underarms then i will connect uh, all together and i will finish knitting up this ball of yarn and when this ball of yarn is done i will uh, just leave it on the cord and i'll start knitting sleeves because I'm planning that uh, each sleeve will take about 100 grams of yarn and when I'm done sleeves then from underarms I will switch to needles 10 millimeters and keep going down in hopes um, because it's super wash merino wool and I hope it will stretch a bit after washing so and hopefully I'll have enough yarn for this larger size cardigan it was very optimistic to order only five skeins i should have ordered six but we'll see maybe i'll have to order another one or maybe it will be enough i don't know but i will work on this project hello friends i hope you enjoyed this new knitting journal see you next time